Hi, this is Sean Overton with OneStepRemove.com. In this video, we're going to go over the Market Replay Manager in NinjaTrader, how to set it up and how you can use it. The purpose for the Market Replay Manager is just to show you the space between the ticks and the, the ticks themselves so that you can simulate how you would react to different market conditions in your own time. So you don't have to sit there in the market in real time and pretend like you're trading. You can do that in the middle of the night, especially if you're teaching yourself how to trade and you want to come home and do that after work. Most people don't find it very convenient to try and practice trade during normal business hours. So the way you set it up is actually pretty easy. You click on Tools and then Options. Click on the Data tab and put a check next to Record for Market Replay. Push OK and you're done. It doesn't seem too complicated and it seems like something else should happen, but that's really all it takes. You want to use this judiciously, so if you plan to follow multiple prices, it can be intensive on the hardware because you're doing a lot of reading and writing, especially if the market's very active. So try to limit the market replay to whatever you want to use and only put the checkbox on when you're actually planning to record data for future use. Otherwise, you're just adding to the overhead for no real benefit. Okay, so we've let a little recording elapse, and now what we need to do is break our connection and go back to the market replay data. You do need to remove the primary connection, so you'll go to disconnect and disconnect from whatever you're connected to, and then you'll go back to file connect, and then you're going to collect or click on the market replay connection. When you do that, you'll notice that this pop this pops up this little window here and when you push play the prices start feeding in and you use this scroll bar to con to decide where in the day you want to focus so if I want to jump ahead to 221 now I can see the current bid and ask at that time and if I want to place buy or sell orders based on this hypothetical price at that moment order push pending okay and you order can see that filled it's working and filled and it updates my sim account as though I were trading it in real time it's that simple uh, if you have any questions on NinjaTrader or the Market Replay Connection, you can find me at www.onestepremove.com. My name is Sean Overton. Thank you for listening.